Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Software Testing by MKT. As a part of this video, I'm going to show you how do we prioritize our test cases in test ng. That means if we have multiple at the rate of test present in the same class, do we have any rights to set our own priority that this should be the first test case and this should be the second test case, right? By the way, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen my previous video before jumping to this class because in the previous video, I have already explained explained you that in case you don't pass the priority in the test cases in the test ng class then it by default takes the alphabetical order of the method name so as a part of this video i'm going to show you how we can add an extra parameter to each annotation of at the rate of test and the parameter that i'm going to utilize here is called as priority right if you set the priority one two three it will take the priority and based on that it will go and execute if you have more than one at the rate of test present in a single program right let us see it practically watch out all you have to do is create a new class and after creating a new class have few at the rate of test annotation so i have added one at the rate of test i imported it i just want to show you by running this what happens if you have one at the rate of test total number of test case will execute is one right but if you have two at the rate of test total number of test cases that will execute is two. Oh, sometimes this synchronization issue can definitely happen please remember guys do not get panic what you can do is save your program again and please try to run the program again when you try to run the program again probably this time you will get the right answer right now you can see total test run equals to two passes is equals to two you know why two because now you got two at the rate of test if you want to have one more at the rate of test you can make it test case equals to three and run it this time it should show that total test cases is equals to three but it is not showing this issues can definitely happen in the test ng do not bother just please run the program once again now you can see total test run equals to three passes three because now i added total three test cases right see guys as of now i have not added any kind of priority so i'm more interested in generating its report if i generate its report it is telling me that test case one got executed first test cases two got executed later and test case three got executed after that you know why that's what we have already discussed in the last video where i told you that if you don't pass the priority it will by default take the alphabetical order of the method name right since all are t t t right so that's why and uh, it is test case one test case two test case three right so it has just taken the alphabetical order of the method name and that's why it is executing in this particular fashion you can verify the same thing here also test case one is getting executed first second is executing later and third one is executing here right but let's suppose this is not you want you want the third test case to execute first right this is what you want so what you can do you can pass the priority equals to minus one you know why minus one we have already discussed in the last video still letting you guys know i have already explained you that the default priority of any annotations in test ng is zero that means if you do not provide any priority the priority is zero right so that means the priority of this is also zero and this is also zero but which one will execute first this one will execute first and this one will execute later but just because you have passed the priority as minus one so you know in minus one zero and and zero which comes first minus one come first so this should get execute first this time let us run this and check after running you can see here test case three got executed first right because you have passed the priority so don't worry about negative priority you can even pass the positive priority but if you are making it as a first so you should definitely make this as a second and you can even make this as a third if this is what priority you are looking for right so i have set my priority and i am running it now after running it i can see the priority here also test case 3 got executed first test case 2 executed later test case 1 executed even after that here also 
I can see total test cases run equals to three. I can even generate the email label report and even check here. So I can see the report now. The total test cases pass is equals to three and all of them are green in color. Guys, remember always to check the priority of any at the rate of test annotation in the test ng. You must check this results of running class three, right? Third class test case three got executed first second got executed later and first one got executed after that just to teach you more i'm going to put the, this one as minus three right now you have one priority one you have one priority two and you have one priority as minus three i am not going to execute this guys i'm giving you this as an assignment please run this in your laptop and let me know if i run this particular class called as three in which my one at the rate of test have priority minus three one at the rate of test have priority two and one at the rate of test have priority one what is going to be my order of execution which method will execute first which method will execute second and which method will execute third i hope this video was useful guys in case yes please give a big thumbs up to this video subscribe to my channel software testing biobility and please share this video with your needy friends see you in the next video till then thank you